Hey, what's going on everybody? Jason here and welcome back to another Zombies video. Today we're playing Black Ops 3 Custom Zombies and to get into the Halloween spirit, we're playing a Minecraft Halloween Custom Zombies map. I saw this on the Steam Workshop as one of the more recent maps to be added to the Steam Workshop, so I figured, what the heck, let's go ahead and download it and let's play it to get into the Halloween spirit. So here we go everybody, Minecraft Halloween. Here we are. Where are we? <laughs> Minecraft Halloween made by Zami. Happy Halloween. All right. Uh, I just realized we started with 666 points and I went prone and got 766. That's funny. Uh, let's see. Shoot all 15 creepers to unlock Perkaholic like that one in the jail there. Ooh. Okay. Okay. So we got to shoot the creepers. I mean, oh, I got to unlock the door. Duh. Uh, free Steve by purchasing the buyable ending. Okay, so that's what we have to do. Uh, you can also play gun game. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of text. <laughs> but uh, every time we knife a zombie, it looks like we got the Minecraft heart pop up like we're dealing damage, I guess. Oh, and the Minecraft music is the round change. That's cool. I like that. All right, so we shot the first creeper. Let's grab some quick revive. Press and hold to make zombies run. Yeah, I don't think I'm about that. Oh my gosh, what? 26,660 points to free, Steve. Our cult is called the Candy Cult. It's not the 1911. This is the Candy Cult, and it's a two-round burst. Also, I just realized, is our, um, is our character the CDL skin from Cold War? It really looks like it, based off the hands alone. I think we have the CDL skin. Uh, what do we have here? 750 door? Let's go. Let's go in here. Oh, we got another creeper. Okay, let's just go ahead and buy this. Uh, TM Pumpkin. All right. Kill that guy. Let's go ahead and open this door. It's 1,500. Oh, we got two ways to go. Let's go this way. What do these pumpkins do? I feel like these pumpkins do something, and I just didn't read the text on the screen because it was going pretty quickly. Oh, my gosh. We're in the mine shaft now. We got Deadshot over here. Oh, another creeper. That helps out for Perkaholic. Uh, oh, the, whoa, hello. Okay, don't kill me, Hero Brian. <laughs> okay, all right, I see how it is. And what else do we have? We have a door up here to go out. So, oh my gosh, look at the outside. Oh my gosh, that looks so cool, actually. 1750? All right, we gotta save up our points. I'm gonna be honest, this is a really cool looking map. I mean, this looks exactly like Minecraft. I and mean, we got redstone ore, we got some iron ore, and it's all the new Minecraft textures, too, from the most recent update. So that's a pretty cool touch, I must say. All right, there we go. We have over 1750 points. Let's go up here and go to the outside out of the mines. Wow, this is cool. Got some houses. We got a little mushroom over here. We got the uh, the spooky pumpkin and the in uh, the witch hat. This is cool. Okay, so we have a two thousand point door to enter this house right here. And what else do we have around here? Ooh, I only have one bullet in my gun. We have a twelve fifty door. Okay, are there any wall weapons around here? Twelve fifty. Oh, there's a wall weapon right there. Uh, but we uh, we need ammo here. Uh, what is this down here? The Phantomas F1. Sure. Okay, interesting. So, all of these guns are just completely reskinned with um, different names and things like that. Kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Oh, how am I supposed to get that? Oh, really? Power ups can spawn out of bounds? Are you serious? Oh my goodness, come on, man. I needed that. <laughs> we do have this door right here made out of the uh, warped nether wood. All right, what's in here? We got the Vector or the Vectorer. Uh, another chest. We can't open these chests. N no diamonds for me? No netherite? Oh, enchanting table? Okay. That would have been cool if the enchanting table was uh, was back a bunch. But we got Juggernaug in here, so that's good to see. Okay, there we go. 1250. Uh, oh, that's a part for Pack-a-Punch, I think. Okay. Got a furnace in here. And th that is it. All right. Well, looks like we got to build a pack a punch somewhere. Okay, let's go ahead and open up the door over here. And let's see where else we have to go. Let's see, what gun is this on the wall? We got the Oh, the ASM1 from Advanced Warfare. Okay. We're at the uh, we're at the graveyard here. Oh, I see a creeper in the distance. There we go. I think we shot four creepers. Ooh, is this banana colada? Hey, that's pretty cool. Oh, do we have to go to the Nether? Oh, 
that's gonna be cool. See, how much is the ASM-1? I'm kinda low on ammo. Uh, okay, 1300, I'll take it. Yeah, I'll take it. I think this is gonna be a good point weapon as well, just like that other gun we had. So how much is this door? 2000, okay. So it's 2000 to go over there, and what I assume would be access the nether. Ooh, we got more creepers here, okay. Five, six, maybe, creepers? How many did the game tell me there was? Like, 16, something like that? Ooh, insta-kill double points. Let's do it. Oh, death machine. Oh, what the hell? The pumpkin blaster. <laughs> this is pretty cool, actually. Open up the door. And what's around here? Hmm, well, we got another perk machine. Oh, Vigor Rush. Yeah, I remember that from Leviathan. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, what is this? I don't even know what that is. Looks like some kind of melee perk. Uh, but we got the nether. Can we go in? Oh, we gotta turn the power on for the nether. Okay. This looks like a great area to train zombies here. Oh, uh, yeah. This is gonna be a great area. Let's build up our points while we're here. And then we're gonna start opening up more of the map. Okay, there are two houses we haven't opened yet. Let's open this house, which looks like this is where... Yeah, the box. Okay. Got a crafting table. Yo, I gotta set my spawn point. <laughs> I gotta set my spawn point. Alright, let's hit the box. And let's see what we get here. Get out of my way, zombie, so you don't kill me. What in the world? We got the intervention. Okay, throwing it back to Modern Warfare 2. Ooh, we got PhD. Got another perk over there. Here's the power, finally. Okay. And we got a part for Pack-a-Punch. Ooh, oh, oh, the game's chugging. Oh, oh, come on, Minecraft. Don't break on me. Oh, maneuver. Oh, I'm dead. I'm, de oh, no, I'm actually dead. There was literally no getting out of that. What was I supposed to do there? Wait, is this another door? Oh, there's another door. Oh, I didn't realize there was another door here at spawn. Oh. Well, that's very cool. Let's go up the stairs. Oh. There's already zombies spawning here. Hero Brian, what are you doing here? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm in Hero Brian's house. I am in Hero Brian's house. I, I apologize for intruding. Um, please do not kill me. We got cookies. Wait, is Hero Brian? Trick or treat? If you can give me some hot cookies, I'll give you a special treat. Oh, okay. One out of three cookies found. Oh, okay. So it's a special Easter egg with Hero Brian. I like that. All right, we got a quick scope. Oh, what is this? Points? Nice. We're quick scoping. We're no scoping. It's Modern Warfare 2. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Shoot the guy in front of you! I'm so dead. Chat! Oh my gosh, I need to get rid of the intervention. I need actually powerful weapons here. That was, uh, that was just sad. Oh no, I'm dead. This is it. Oh, I'm actually dead. This is it. I gotta restart. I'm gonna restart. Damn, dude, that sucks. Oh, speak with Hero Brian and complete his quest to unlock the Pack Punch room. So that's what Hero Brian is. Okay. All right. See, there were so many things going on. <laughs> there were so many things going on on the on the screen. There was all the text earlier on the first playthrough that I just couldn't read it all. Cold cookie. Ah, uh, I see. So we do have to warm up the cookies. Hero Brian said he wanted hot cookies. So yeah, we gotta find furnaces. Gotta find furnaces or campfires or something to warm up those cookies. So as of now, everybody, we are caught up from our last game where we unfortunately died. We're gonna hit the box again here. The AM Pumpkin 63. Okay, well, if this is anything like Cold War's AMP, this should be pretty good, hopefully. But now that we have the power on, we can go to the nether. Let's go to the nether. Ooh. Oh, this is so cool, actually. What? This is so cool. We gotta like parkour. Oh my goodness, okay. Um, this is this is really cool. So double taps over there. Wait, zombies don't spawn in here. Oh, okay, that makes sense because you know, these this, this parkour looks pretty difficult actually. Ooh, we got a shield part? Ooh, oh, and a creeper. There we go. Hop, I missed. Okay, well, uh, Am I stuck? No, I don't think I'm stuck. What is this? Another part? Oh, it's a pack punch part. Oh, I think we have all the pack punch parts now. Okay, nice. My only hope is that when we come back from the nether, 
I hope the zombies aren't all huddled up next to the portal and then I just get my ass kicked. Where, where am I even going? Like, I actually don't know where I'm supposed to go. I guess I'll go this way. Uh, who? I, I'm just going somewhere. I don't know where I'm going. Uh, oh, it's a part. Oh, it's the Ray Gun Mark II for 6,000 points. Are you serious? Oh, that's actually so cool. Well, I don't have 6,000 points, so, um, I guess, I guess I'll leave the nether. <laughs> well, the nether is a pretty cool place in this Minecraft zombies map, but uh, I need 6,000 points before I can return. So we have all the pack-a-punch parts, and we need to bring that over to Hero Brian, but we need cookies to give to Hero Brian, so Hero Brian can even let us access Pack a Punch. So I guess we gotta go look for some cookies. Oh my gosh, how did I miss that? There's a part in one of the jail cells at spawn. How in the hell did I miss that? So where is that other door? There's a door over here somewhere that we have to open that I didn't open last time. So let's go over here. Here it is. We have stamina up. And, oh, a shield part. Okay, there we go. So now I think we can go ahead and uh, build the shield. All right, the spectral shield. Perfect. All right, we got the blood of the dead shield. So the only thing left for us to do is to save up 6,000 points, buy the ray gun mark II from the nether, and we got to open up Pack-a-Punch from, uh, from Hero Brian's room there. So yeah, I still haven't found any of the other cookies, but I guess I'll keep looking. Wait, what was that? Oh, hey, there's a cookie right here on this chest. How did I walk past that like a bunch of times? Okay, two out of three cold cookies found. And there it is. And there it is, out in the open. Out in the open. And I totally missed it. Wow. That was, uh... All right, let's go to this furnace, see if this warms them up. No? I mean, I know you can't put cookies in a furnace in Minecraft, but like... Eh, worth a shot. I mean, come on, right? Like, the furnace, the thing in Minecraft that heats up all your shit, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't work for this. There are no other furnaces on this map. I don't know, guys. I mean, that's gotta, that's gotta be it, right? One in the chat if we look up how to do this. Two in the chat, uh, if we try to figure this out on our own. Alright, I see some ones in the chat. Okay, we're gonna look this up. We're gonna look up how to do this. Oh, dude, that's actually so smart. Okay, my initial thought was correct. We do have to use that furnace, but what do you use to power a furnace in Minecraft? You use coal to power up a furnace in Minecraft. We have to go mining for some coal. And that coal is somewhere over here. All right, there we go. Now to get cooking. So now we bring it over to the furnace and we bake our cookies. I thought the coal was just a set decoration like all the other ore. Very sneaky. Okay, here we go. Baking the cookies. Hey, there we go. Hope Herobrine likes these. I hope so too, because then he'll just kill us. So yeah, I'm hoping Herobrine likes it too. All right, Herobrine, I have your cookies. There we go. Mmm, yes, very good. <laughs> All right. Ah, pick up diamonds. There we go. What can three diamonds be used for? Ah, uh, three diamonds can be used for a pickaxe. I was right about diamond pickaxe. How do we get a diamond pickaxe, you might ask? We gotta get some wood. We gotta get some wood, right? We gotta mine these trees. Oh my gosh, what is this game? Hello, crafting table. Craft a stick. There we go. Place the diamonds. Craft the diamond pickaxe. Take the diamond pickaxe. Got to bring it back to Hero Brian, right? Maybe. Or we use this to mine something else. Mine obsidian. Maybe. Mine some netherite. I don't. I don't know. I mean, the only obsidian in this map. Okay, I was about to say the only obsidian in this map is uh, is the one from the nether portal, but I guess not. Yo, what the heck? This is cool as hell. All right. Craft a pack punch. You know what? Just um, get get yeah, get out of here, zombie. I let me let me just craft pack punch in peace. 
Well, there we go, guys. We got Pack a Punch unlocked. All right, that was a that was a cool quest. I like the uh, Minecraft integration of the of the entire thing. That was cool. Ooh, the ray gun mark too. We don't even have to go buy it out of the nether now. There we go. All right. The peacekeeper. Oh, the peacekeeper doesn't have a cool Minecraft camo or anything. Damn. Well, let's pack punch the peacekeeper while we have it, right? And we have, ah, the Garad Krovi pack punch camo. I will take that. That looks pretty cool. All right. Let's pack punch the mark two. Zombies go away. Let me pack punch in peace. Ooh, the Raygun Mark II looks awesome with the Garad Krovi pack a punch camo. Yeah, that looks great, actually. Ah, there's a creeper. Ooh, that was the last creeper. Yeah, there we go, guys. We got Perkaholic. Hell yeah. All right, we've done everything on this map. And now we just have to save up for the viable ending. Oh my gourd. <laughs> That's a great name for a gun. Oh my god. Or, or my gourd. This is, uh, this thing's pretty good, actually, and it's not even pack-a-punched. Wow. It's pretty loud, too, actually. It's a gun from Advanced Warfare? Oh, I didn't recognize it, to be honest. Gotta go pack-a-punch the Oh My Gourd. Unending. Oh, it got rid of the, the Minecraft camo, but, uh, it's got some other kind of blueprint thing going on for it. What rating do we give this map out of 10? Honestly... I gotta give this map like an 8 or a 9. This was really fun. Really creative map, I think. Got to, uh, got to experience the best of both worlds. Minecraft and zombies. Oh, wait, what the heck did I just do? What? It's got two firing modes? I mean, this one seems like it just eviscerates the zombies. What in the world? Alright, we definitely have more than enough points. Let's head back to spawn. Let's go ahead and free Steve. Hello, Steve. You are free. Thanks for playing. Happy Halloween, folks. Well, there you have it, everybody. Halloween Minecraft Zombies. This was a really fun map. I'll leave a link to this map down below in the description of this video. What was your favorite part? Share your thoughts in the comments. And with that said, thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy and you haven't already, leave a like and subscribe if you're a brand new viewer. And check out all the links down below in the description so you stay up to date with everything that I do. And with that said, have a fantastic rest of your day or night, depending on where you are in this crazy world. And I'll see you guys next time.